This looks inspired by two players, Sean Lane and Tom Quayle. The start is uh, taken from my Sean Lane inspiration, and we finish off with a, a Tom Quayle-like uh, legato uh, run to end. Um, now, this may not necessarily be indicative of what you think of when you, you hear these two players, but this is certainly something I hear uh, in their playing. So, the Sean Lane bit is this ascending pentatonic run, and something Sean Lane does he'll, is he'll he'll do runs in odd groupings, so quintuplets and, and septuplets, so seven in the space of uh, eight or seven in the space of six and things like that. He also does things where he'll do straight um, 16th or eighth note runs, but he'll... Um, phrase the the lick slightly differently so this is a straight 16th or, or, or 32nd note run and um we're grouping the notes well, it's quite oddly so we've got a group of six then a group of five then a group of five uh, to finish off and then we end on that 12th fret on what would be the one beat for the next chord and i'm hybrid picking this because i just find it um the best way to get a smooth sound across the strings so th the the only reason i say um uh put tom quayle's name in there is because that's the sort of uh, legato that I've improved after watching his videos. Anyway, practice this one slowly. I I'm going to play it slowly and then up to speed. Um, it's, a, it's a really cool lick. Now, we're in standard tuning rather than all fourths, because I wrote this while I was at work. If you want to play this in all fourths, you should be able to um, adjust this fairly easily. Apologies if there's any um, reduction in quality this week. I'm having some camera troubles. And if you hear some scuttling around, that'll be my cat chasing a foil ball um, as... Uh, as the lick's going. So um, best of luck with this one. Try and incorporate it into your playing and try and move it around different pentatonic shapes as well because we are just in one shape here um, and you can get loads of interesting sounds with this kind of odd note grouping. So um, have uh, have fun with this and I'll see you next week. Okay.